We have a next speaker, young speaker. Amen. He's a good speaker. All right. But James, you're going to put the time on him, all right? Okay. Amen. Yeah. We're going to do the bell now. Uh, when he got two more minutes, you sound the bell. All right. Uh, you know, he's going to sound the bell, all right. Do you Amen. 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 Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But he's a dynamic uh, uh, speaker, and we love him. Uh, his roots go back a long way as far as the Word of God is concerned. So we love him and we thank God and he's going to give us a good, strong 15 minutes. All right? Amen. Fall in love with him over and over and over and over again. And I keep falling in love with him over and over and over and over again and he gets sweeter and sweeter as the day go by oh what a love between my savior and i keep falling in love with him over and over and over and over again Preached us all the way to heaven. All yeah. the way. Amen. 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 Heaven and back. God bless yeah. you, brother Henry. Thank, Thank you for an outstanding job. Thank you, Brother Kegler. I have a friend in California who, uh, when I told him that uh, what I was going to be doing today, he was uh, uh, kind of like, you know, oh, they they need to get a building or something. They ain't going to be able to keep this house church stuff up for that long. But I tell Amen. you, there's some faithful saints here. That, yes, sir. Uh, so, uh, they're going to be it's, it's here, and it just, it's a packed house in here. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. I go into church buildings a lot of times, and sometimes you don't even see. I've gone to some places with less people than this. Amen. A building of four, five hundred. So, yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> Uh, we appreciate. It. I don't know if it's just the food. I don't know what it is. But, uh, <laughs> it's a we're here this morning uh, for the spiritual Amen. meal uh, from God. CSI in the church. CSI. Yes, sir. We're going in we're the going. church. We're going CSI in the church. I've got to uh, get on this uh, plane and land real quick. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Uh, give you a couple good nuggets. <laughs> uh, then we. Uh, I take my seat. Amen. Jesus is given a sermon on the mount. Jesus is the master teacher. And Jesus is teaching his disciples in Matthew chapter 7. Yeah. Uh -huh. And he is instructing them on how if they want to be kingdom citizens. Come on now. If they want to be uh, kingdom dwellers, how they how to live, and how they ought to serve and how that the world, he, he turned things upside down. Yeah, yeah. He said that the blessed are the meek. Yeah. Uh, those that serve, they're the ones that are going to be blessed. Yeah, Not yeah, those yeah, that yeah. want to take. The oh, world yeah. says the more you step yeah. on people, come on, so you climb the ladder. But <laughs> Jesus said yeah. the more that you serve people, that you yeah. bow down, that yeah. you, yeah. that's how you'll be blessed. He yeah. Said, those that are poor in spirit. Yeah. They are blessed. And yeah. Those when men revile you, uh -huh. persecute you, yeah. say all manner of evil against you, uh -huh. great is your reward uh -huh. in heaven. Amen. 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 Come on. So when you. they talk about you, when they lie on you, uh -huh. Jesus said you're blessed. And yeah. To them, people have the idea of blessing just means a diamond in the back and a sun in the Come on, Jesus didn't say that's blessing all. Amen. Amen. So he said blessing is when you are the salt of the earth and the light of the world and you live in a good way. Jesus said that's how you're blessing. And Jesus says when you give to men, don't, don't be all extravagant of how when you give to people. Don't let your left hand know and, and don't know what your right hand is doing. And yeah, and yeah, Jesus yeah. says that you should lay up some treasures in heaven and don't yeah. just worry about how you live on this earth, but lay up some treasures 
in heaven. Yeah. yeah. Come on. So with Jesus it. says in Matthew 7, come on, what is I don't have time. He gave the most mis, uh, mis, misinterpreted verse in the Bible. Don't, you know, judge not that you be not judged. Many people have the idea that that means you can't say anything. If you say a crime, they say that that's wrong. But, but we don't have time to deal with that. But in Matthew 7, 21, all right, Jesus, after he taught about alms giving and being blessed and laying up treasures and seeking first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and, and all that and don't worry and all kind of great things, he says, not everyone, not everyone, not everyone. who says to me, Lord, Lord, Hmm. Shall enter the kingdom of heaven. Right, right. Right. But he who does the will of my Father in heaven. Yeah. Amen. And the reason why many are not doing the will of God, if you want to know what God, if you came in here this morning going to be saved, well, if you came here this morning seeking God and want to know what God's will is, come on. There are a lot of false teachers. Yeah. yeah. And you got to know the doctrine of Christ. Yeah. Second John 9 said that whosoever transgresses and abideth not in the doctrine of Christ hath not God. Yeah. He that abideth in the doctrine of Christ hath both the Father and the Son. Yeah. If you want to know how to please God, you got to know the teaching of Jesus. Yeah. Yes, sir. You got to know that Jesus died for your sins. Amen. You got to know that God loves you. But yeah. that Jesus wants you. Jesus said, I said about Jesus in Hebrews 5 and 8, though he were a son. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yet yeah. learned the obedience by the things which he suffered. Yeah. And being made perfect, he became the author of eternal salvation unto all them yeah. that obey him. Amen. Amen. The reason why many don't know God is because teachers are teaching them doctrine that's not found in the book. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. They're uh -huh. teaching them what sounds good. That God is a genie. That you can have whatever you want. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you just hold your nose a little bit <laughs> and just say, God, I believe in you. And I want a Lexus. I want an Ashton Martin. Yeah. I, I want a new suit. There yeah. you go. There you go. But that's not found in the Bible. Talk, talk, talk. Amen. And the crime scene in the church yeah. is that the doctrine, we're, we're not teaching doctrine anymore. Come we're on, teaching man. philosophy Woo. and poetry and Come Plato on. and Aristotle and Socrates oh, and, it, and love and and little Wayne and uh -huh. there you go, they gonna preach it. We're teaching poetry and other stuff, but we're not teaching what is doctrine. It. That's, it. Right. That's it. We're not teaching what is written. It. It. And I, I, when I get to five minutes, somebody really? <laughs> let me know when I get to five minutes. But, <laughs> but he says that. Everyone who says to me, he's talking about those who are his disciples. He does not talking to the world. He's talking to his disciples. That everyone who just says, Lord, Lord, Jesus mm. said in Luke 6, 46. Yeah. yeah. Why call you me Lord, 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 Lord and do not the things that I say? Yeah. See, you can call Jesus Lord, mm. but not submit to his authority. Well. Yeah. You can call Jesus Lord, right. but just want the goodies from Jesus. Well, uh -huh. yes. But he said, not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, shall enter, but yes. he who does the will of my Father. Amen. First Timothy says that God would have all men to be saved. Yeah. Uh -huh. So if you're not doing what would lead men to be saved, you're not doing God's will. Amen. If you're not going about spreading the word and Come teaching on, the, the gospel, if you're not living according to what God says, you're not doing his will. Yeah. Mm. Whoever does the will that's it. of the Father. Come on, man. If you want to get to help, see, we all are criminals at the cross. Yeah. Uh -huh. We're just almost all like in Luke 23 when that thief yeah, yeah. Asked to, to come to be in paradise. We 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 might think, you 
know, I don't care how, you know, before I came here, Brother Kegler, you know, something I was looking sharp. I think I'm looking kind of shabby today. Uh, but, uh, That's all right. Uh, but, but we all really That's all right. are criminals yeah. at the cross. Yeah. yeah. And we all need Jesus. Yeah. Oh, we're not good enough to get to heaven on our own. No. Yeah. That's we're right, not, that's we, right. we can't dot all the I's and cross all the T's to get to heaven. It's only going to be because of Jesus that you get to heaven. Amen. 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 And you got to do what he said. Jesus said he built his church. Yeah. He built the church of Christ. Jesus yeah. said that you got to hear his word and believe right. it. Jesus said that you got to obey his doctrine. That's what yeah. Jesus said. Yes, sir. Amen. Now, let me get a reader. John, I think it's John 12, 48. Let me, let, I'm going to read that. That's a good one. And then I think I'm going to, I think my time probably is going out. But notice what Jesus says here. He that rejected me, he who rejects me, this is Jesus talking. And received not my word. And received not my word. Had one that judged him. All right, read. And the word that I have spoken, the word I have spoken, the same shall judge him in the last day. The word that Jesus, see, you got to understand what Jesus, see, what people say will sound good. You know, even I've got a Bible at home. I was teaching last week, Brother Kegel, on faith. Yeah. At a church about 150 miles away from here. Yeah. And I was talking about the faith. But you got in some Bibles, they say faith. They put faith means, that's that's their idea of a plan of salvation. Faith is for forgiveness and A is for available and I and T and A. Yeah, yeah. And they believe you just say a prayer yeah, yeah, that you're yeah, going to be yeah. saved. Yeah. yeah. But Jesus never said that. Come on, buddy. Right. Yes, sir. But man will put in a book, all you got to do is pray yeah. to be saved. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But Jesus didn't say that. Mm -hmm. Come on now. Jesus said, he that believeth. Uh -huh. And is baptized yeah, shall, be, shall be saved. That's what she, you don't find a man praying a prayer to be saved in the Bible. My Lord. Uh -huh. But man will, you know, man, it sounds good, you know, uh -huh. but Jesus yes, said, sir. he that believe it <laughs> and is baptized yeah. shall be saved. Shall be saved. That's what Jesus said. Well, <laughs> and Jesus built his church and he gave the keys to the kingdom to, and when they heard about Jesus on Pentecost when Peter preached the gospel he asked them a, they asked what shall we do they don't they understood they crucified Jesus and with wicked hands they had done all these things and they said what shall we do and he said say a prayer mm. he said it he said go to mourners bench uh -huh. He said, go and talk about your Christian experience. No, he said, repent. Yes, sir. And be baptized. Be baptized. Amen. Every one of you in the name of yeah, Jesus Christ for the remission Amen. of sin. And you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. And it goes on to talk about the promises unto you and to your children, to all that are far off, and as many as the Lord our God shall call. But Jesus, when you hear about Jesus, it ought to lead to some water. Uh -huh. In Acts 8, when Philip preached about Jesus, Mm -hmm. That eunuch went to some water. Yes, uh -huh. sir. Uh, Lydia heard about Jesus. Yeah. She went to some water. Uh -huh. Yeah. And Jailer heard about Jesus. Come on, that boy. That led her to some water. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 about Jesus. You, you ought to say, take me to the water. Amen. 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 About Jesus. My Lord. Not about your experience and about your testimony until you become saved. We all have, all of us really have a testimony. All, all of us, all of us have a testimony that God has done something for us. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. But that's not enough to save you. Amen. Mm -hmm. You got to obey what Jesus said. Yeah. Like he said it. And that's how you're going to be saved. My Lord. Amen. And the crime seen in the church is that we are not doing what God says and we're not preaching the doctrine of Christ. We're preaching. Sometimes what make people feel good. My Lord. Yeah. Uh -huh. and I, well, I don't have time to go into all that. But this is, I know it's a scripture that says something about that they have proof they have itching ears. Yeah. 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 They'll yeah. away their ears yeah. and they'll be turned yeah. to some fables uh -huh. and they'll hear what they want to hear. But yeah. Yeah. thank y'all for being a great yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let the church say amen. 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 We're going to wrap this up and. Um, I kind of wish that I would have went first. Yeah, <laughs> yeah these brothers here. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 God, God is good. Great. We're just so grateful that everyone thought in that robbery. We uh, we are not in the pretty business. Uh, yes, sir. We are in the soul saving business. That's and we wanted to prove that you can start a house church yeah. and build it and build it right and get some land, get a property, and use that property not just two days a week, but yes, seven sir. days a week. Amen. 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 That's, 